A woman from Sacramento is accused of punching a flight attendant in the face, knocking out two of her teeth, and she was booked into jail. This happened on Sunday morning on board a Southwest Airlines flight from Sacramento to San Diego, delaying some passengers on their next leg by five hours. This comes as incidents with unruly passengers are on the rise nationwide. Tonight, News 8's Abby Alford spoke with the woman who claims it was self-defense, but witnesses say that's not what happened. I spoke to the Sacramento passenger on the phone. She's accused of assaulting a Southwest flight attendant on a plane when it landed here in San Diego. She claims it was self-defense, but other passengers say she was in the wrong. Images of a flight attendant's bloodied face after stewarding flight 700 from Sacramento to San Diego Sunday morning may be hard to see. And next time I saw, don't touch me, they start yelling, right? Sacramento chef Taro Arai captured these images after the assault, but witnessed the attack. Arai says that he turned to grab his cell phone. As soon as I turn around, the lady stood up and and then she just knocked her out on the floor. You see the flight attendant in the back of the plane bloodied. Witnesses say two of her teeth were knocked out. Another Sacramento witness says that this started when the plane landed in San Diego and the passenger refused to put her seatbelt on when the plane was still taxiing. Susan Marie Stidman recorded the woman being escorted off the plane by Harbor Police. And people ought to be ashamed for that type of behavior. The flight attendant was treated at Scripps Memorial Hospital. She is recovering. I'm giving her her privacy to recover and obviously get over the shock of this since it just occurred. Lynn Montgomery is the president of the union representing Southwest Airlines flight attendants and wrote this letter to Southwest CEO Gary Kelly asking for more protections. It's absolutely deplorable and we just will not stand for it. There's been a rise in unruly passengers nationwide. The FAA reports airlines have reported 4,000 passengers have been banned for bad behavior in the last year. No! Southwest reports from April to May there were 477 incidents. We're going to need the government to do more to make sure that our aircraft and our passengers and crew are safe. Southwest says it does not condone or tolerate verbal or physical abuse of flight crews. The Port of San Diego says that Harbor Police arrested 28-year-old Viviana Quinones for battery causing great bodily injury. She posted $35,000 bail and is scheduled to be in court on September 30th.